Hi, my name's Kath Fashuk. I'm a learning technologist at the University of Manchester. Uh, and I'm John Owen. I'm a lecturer in technology and enhanced learning also at the University of Manchester. Uh, in this short video, we're going to explain what are student staff partnerships. So what are student staff partnerships, John? Well, student staff partnerships are an increasingly common student engagement practice in higher education. And the common definition states that partnerships are a collaborative reciprocal process through which all participants have the opportunity to contribute equally, although not necessarily in the same ways, to curricular or pedagogical conceptualization, decision making, implementation, investigation or analysis. So what does that all actually mean? Well, working in partnership with students has the potential to empower them to take an active role in their own educational experience and their insights and active engagement in these processes can also help influence and continually improve our own teaching and learning practice which emphasizes the reciprocal nature of the partnership process student partnerships provide an alternative to the students as customers paradigm and can challenge he norms and power structures where academics are seen as the gatekeepers of knowledge they have the potential to address issues of inclusivity and transform learning and teaching into truly collaborative processes. So the University of Manchester's strategic vision identifies student partnerships as a key priority under the core goal of teaching and learning. And that is to work in partnership with our students, inspiring them to build their own unique student experiences in a framework of excellence and social and civic responsibility. The Higher Ed Education Academy has also developed a framework for working with students as partners and identified the following areas in which student staff partnerships can take place. Um, so they are uh, learning, teaching and assessment, curriculum design and pedagogic consultancies, subject based research and inquiry and scholarship of teaching and learning. So, John, could you give us some examples of um, partnerships? Uh, yeah, so they might include uh, ways to improve assessment and feedback methods, um, partnership processes looking at conducting pedagogic research, um, initiatives to facilitate peer learning, and probably the most popular, uh, co-creation in the curriculum and co-creation of the curriculum. And we'll explain the differences between those two uh, in a later video. Uh, finally, the student numbers uh, involved in partnership initiatives can range from an individual student right through to a whole course unit or a program of study or even wider uh, such as the University of Manchester peer assisted study sessions program. 